What is up guys, welcome back to the channel. Here on today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to turn on two-factor authentication here inside of Fortnite Chapter 3 Season 4 with the quickest and simplest way possible. But before we go ahead and start with this video, I just want to let you guys know that I am gifting my subscribers whatever they want from the item shop. So, if you want a chance to get a free gift from me, it can be basically whatever you want from the item shop, like any skin, bundle, back bling, pickaxe, wrap, emotes, anything from the item shop, including the current season's battle pass. All you want to go ahead and do for a chance is basically subscribe to the channel, like this video, and comment down below your Epic Games username. That's all you want to go ahead and do. Subscribe to the channel, like this video, and comment down below your Epic Games username. And if you want like a specific item, let me know in the comments down below as well. So now let's quickly head inside of this video. Just like I told you guys in today's video, I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to turn on two-factor authentication here inside of Fortnite Chapter 3 Season 4 to get a free emote and secure your account. So two-factor authentication actually secures your account in a really good way. So you might wanna go ahead and turn it on. And in today's video, I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to turn it on with the quickest and simplest way possible. So now let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing you should do is basically make your way to the main lobby of Fortnite exactly where I am. Once you guys basically go ahead and make your way to the main lobby of Fortnite, you're going to go ahead and basically look up on your screen and then see a tab located right over here on the screen. So basically go ahead and click on that tab and after you go ahead and click on that tab, you're going to look over here and there's like there's going to be a bunch of other tabs. So we have this one, we have this one, we have this one. We have looking for party, we have a voice chat, we have menu, and we have a bunch of other tabs over here just like this. So from here, this is what you guys want to go ahead and basically do. So you're going to basically go ahead and look down on your screen and then like see all these tabs. So we have, just like I told you guys, we have this one right here with your equipped skin, and then we have friends right here, you can see your friends. We have add friends, you can see your friend invites and send other people invites. And then we have this one with looking for party. You can basically turn this on and find other players to play the game with. And then we have a voice chat. You can basically do your voice options. So we have a menu. And this is what you guys are going to go ahead and do. So you're going to come over here and choose the menu tab from here and make your way to the menu just like this. So when you go ahead and basically arrive at the menu tab just like this, when you go ahead and take a look on your screen, you can see that there's a bunch of other tabs on your screen. So we have legal, support and refunds, reporting, parental controls, and settings. So this is what you guys want to go ahead and do. Basically go ahead and choose the settings tab from here and after you go ahead and choose the settings tab from here, it's just going to take you inside of the main settings menu of Fortnite Chapter 3 Season 4. So when you go ahead and basically arrive at this location just like this, there's going to be a bunch of other things you can basically just do the settings of. So we have a bunch of other sections, a bunch of other tabs, you can do all these settings and we're going to go ahead and basically turn on a really important setting in order to go ahead and basically turn on two-factor authentication here inside of Fortnite Chapter 3 Season 4. So now let's go ahead and basically take a look at that. Just like I said, when you go ahead and basically arrive at the main settings menu of Fortnite Chapter 3 Season 4, you're going to look up on your screen and then you're going to see a bunch of other tabs. So we have video. This is the default one. Like uh, when you go ahead and basically click on the settings tab, it's just going to take you inside of this one. And then we have the second one, which is going to be the game tab. Just right next to that one, we have another one, which is called game UI and right next to this one we have another one called touch and emotion and right next to this tab over here we have this one which is basically called mouse and keyboard just right next to it we have this one which is called controller options and right next to the controller options we have audio and from audio we have this one which is called keyboard controls and just right next to it we have wireless controller and this is basically what you can do. So you're gonna look over here and click this tab, which is going to be called account and privacy. So when you go ahead and basically make your way to the account and privacy tab, there's gonna be like a bunch of other sections on the screen, a bunch of different sections, but a bunch of different settings. In them. So if you take a look over here, we can see that we have the account section, and then we have the social privacy section, and then we have the gameplay privacy section, and then we have credit section and the legal section. So most of these sections actually have 
there are like kinds of settings inside of them. So we're going to go ahead and basically turn on a really specific setting to go ahead and basically get the reward from the two-factor authentication because like you can get a free emote by turning it on. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how to turn it on and how to basically get the reward because you really don't want to miss like a free emote in Fortnite. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and basically make your way to the account and privacy tab just like this. Just like I told you, there's a bunch of other sections. So from these sections, you're going to make your way to the section over here, which is called a social privacy. So I'm going to go ahead and basically find the social privacy section. There's a bunch of other settings inside of it. So we have filter mature language, friend invites permission, and then we have hide your linked social account names. And then we have a text chat, and then we have can receive gifts, and then we have party joinability. So when you go ahead and see all these uh, different sections and all these settings over here, just like this, this is basically what you guys want to go ahead and basically do. So you're going to look over here and there's going to be this setting over here called a party joinability. And when you go ahead and take a look up, this is going to be the setting you want to go ahead and basically turn on and it's called can receive gifts. So this is actually really, really important because if you want to go ahead and basically turn it on just like this, this is going to let you get the emote, the free emote from the two factor authentication. So you're going to go ahead and basically make Make sure this is turned on just like that. So let's say if it was on, off for you, all you gotta do is come over here and click this arrow to basically go ahead and turn it on just like that. So when you go ahead and turn it on just like that, all you gotta do is come over here to the car corner of your screen and basically see this tab that says apply. So go ahead and click on it just like this. And when you go ahead and click on it and make sure this setting is turned on for you, I'm gonna go ahead and show you the next step in the website of Epic Games itself. All right, guys, so for the last step, this is what you guys want to go ahead and do. Make your way to the epicgames.com website exactly where I am. So after you guys go ahead and basically make your way to the epicgames.com website, this is the page you will go ahead and see on your screen. So when you go ahead and see this page on your screen, you're going to look up on the corner and basically see this area that's going to say your account name. So if you haven't logged in yet, basically go ahead and log into your account and then you will be on this page just like this. Once you guys basically go ahead and log in, you're going to br bring your cursor right around here and it will say account and basically go ahead and click this account tab just like that after you guys click on the account tab this is the next thing you're going to be seeing on your screen so we have all these tabs on our screen so we have general communications payment management transactions parental controls subscriptions pa password and security etc etc so from here this is what you guys want to go ahead and basically do you're going to come over here and choose the password and security tab just like this and once you guys choose this tab just like that there's going to be like a bunch of different things on the screen so when you go ahead and basically make your way to this location just like this you're going to come over here and basically scroll down a little bit and find this place that says two-factor authentication. So when you go ahead and basically find this place that says two-factor authentication, these are the methods you can basically go ahead and do two-factor authentication with. So we have third-party authenticator app, SMS authentication, email authentication. So for me, I chose email authentication because in my opinion, that's the best one. But if you want to do something else, you might want to go ahead and do that as well. So these are all the methods. You can actually go ahead and do two-factor authentication here inside of Fortnite Chapter 3 Season 4 to basically go ahead and get a free emote and secure your account. So that's basically how we can go ahead and do this. If you want to see more videos like this one, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, like this video, and turn on those post notifications so you don't miss out any future uploads from me. I will see you later in different videos. Bye.